tase me, I will f***ing headbutt you in the nose. First, they tased, pepper sprayed, and then shot him with rubber bullets. And tonight, a group of women bounty hunters got another chance at a wanted man in a bizarre arrest, all captured on video. The latest arrest happened just 24 hours ago. And tonight, one of those bounty hunters told 10 News how it all went down. 10 News reporter Itika Milanas is joining us now with the lawsuit being filed against the bounty hunters and the growing list of others also being sued. Itika? Kimberly and Steve, I got a copy of the lawsuit and this list of defendants just keeps on growing. 18 people so far. The latest arrest of Daniel Duvall took place at his Orange County home, but as you're about to see, it was still pure chaos. You guys are making a big mistake. You're kidnapping me. The lipstick bounty hunters were back at it Tuesday night. Please don't resist. On the hunt for Daniel Duvall, the same man in this video 10 News was first to show you last month, being shot by rubber bullets and arrested at an Arby's by a trio of women bounty hunters wearing pink t shirts. The team was hired by a bail bondsman to revoke bail for drug and weapon charges. After the first attempt failed, they just keep pushing it, pushing it, pushing it because it, they, um, they keep getting media attention. They tried again Tuesday night at Duvall's home in Westminster. If you tase me, I will headbutt you in the nose. Uh, Mr. Duvall did not resist, however, he was not very cooperative. But this time they had help from another bounty hunter. They're the ones that went in and effectuated the arrest, handed them over to Lipstick, who took all the glory. Duvall's attorney Dan Gillian says the women went too far in the first attempt, shooting Duvall twice in the eye and breaking his nose. But Teresa Gold disagrees. We believe we did not use enough force. Are you serious? You didn't use enough force? Are you saying that you should have brought a real gun and shot him dead? Every single time they talk, it helps me prove my case. Duval is out of jail and hoping to see his eye doctor who is here in San Diego this week. His attorney believes those bounty hunters are just trying to get a reality show out of this, something those women deny. Itika Milanis, 10 News.